way back, back into time. After most of the spots in the U.S. being poached up and reused and overused, it's uh, it's nice to travel outside and look for new stuff. And uh, we knew Barcelona would be a good place to start. Apparently, it was a city that was escape or bike friendly. Getting ready? I'm doing it, man. Do you know any Spanish? Um, maybe in Spanish. Which one do you have? Very young, uh, Spanish. You took German in high school. Well, I ain't gonna do this no good. We ain't going to Germany yet. <laughs> So after 15 hours on the plane, got to the airport, got the bags, got the car, drove to the apartment, got everyone moved in, settled in. The neighbors aren't going to be psyched. Everyone just put their bikes together and started riding. The first day we got here, we walked out the door, rode for like two or three minutes, and Van's pointing out some ledge, and I look ahead and I'm like, look at that wall ride. First thing we find ridiculous, and I've looked for it in my hometown forever, and just ride down the road here and find it in two seconds. I was really excited when I got here and things were working out. We were riding a whole lot. I never met a bunch of the guys on the trip. And we all haven't been together in the same spot before, so it was interesting to see what would happen. <laughs> After finding a bunch of spots the first day, we, everybody was psyched to uh, see what else the city had to offer. So um, after a good night's sleep, we uh, hit the streets again. We were just cruising around, just hoping to find something. We found a couple of things. Well, we went to one spot and I didn't like it, so I sat on a bench. <laughs> and I realized the bench had tranny. We had magazines with uh, spots from Barcelona and tried to match them up to uh, any person that we thought would know where it was at. No, no comprende? That's how we found spots right away.
spot in Barcelona called M-A-C-B-A. It's a museum and I heard it was gonna get redesigned, so I didn't really think I was gonna get to ride it. Finally got there in time to do what I had to do. something i know that that instrument is called a didgeridoo and no one believes me the didgeridoo is uh they're called Ab the aboriginal people of australia would play those that's uh it's a native tribal dance they get the warriors excited to go kick some ass i just want to know what the event is we got we got some kind of heating system or something. Let's put tranny on top of it in a sub box and see if anyone rides it.
Barcelona, there's crazy sculptures and uh, like playgrounds and stuff that are perfectly made to ride on, you know, crazy dragons that are, you know, made into a slide and somehow you can ride them. We was riding down the street, we heard some uh, somebody calling us, then we turned around and there was this kid named Fernando. He told us to meet us the next day at this certain spot. There's like a little Universidad Square. We would meet up there pretty much every day. Vic pulled the longest ice pick grind in the world while we waited. And then uh, just hopped on the train. I mean, one of my favorite things though is there's this tranny that went straight up to a wall and it's really good. You can air out of the top of it and do all sorts you of You could air out of the top of it. This time you got it all figured out. down off the wall. Uh, the locals and the workers were really cool. The guy that owned the thing came out and he just picked up the panel and said, oh, I need this panel because I'm going to have to fix it later and just let us keep riding. By the end of the session, we had two panels to fix. La compañía. ¿Un res? Mira.
too tired to even bunny hop up the curb. I just wanted to ride some tranny. It was just this tranny in the <laughs> middle of the sidewalk. Wedge to stage. Um, I just seen a whole bunch of videos and uh, magazines. I just wanted to do some stuff on it. I got to come to Barcelona and do some of the stuff I wanted to do on it. Out, like you're gonna do a poop noob. It wasn't that high, but it was pretty far back. If you fell down, it wasn't pretty bad news. And he's just giving it this look, and you can just tell something's about to go down. And it did. One of the days it rained all day, we got rained out, but um, it gave us a chance to do some touristy stuff. We took a couple tours and we saw like Antonio Gotti's, you know, he's a famous artist and, uh, you know, architect and we went to his big cathedral and it was, uh, it was like kind of dark and evil looking, but it was, uh, it's pretty scary. <laughs> Educational and fun. Even though we only have one day of rain, people were starting to get restless. <laughs>
really good hip and everyone was feeling it out. Justin was blasting it. Out of nowhere, Mikey comes barreling out of this alley and just jumps, you know, the whole thing from end to end. In Barcelona, basically, all the spots are at train stations. As soon as you go to the train station, they got this one ledge that goes down, then turns into a rail. Then, uh, that was a pretty funny video, so I was wanting to ride with <laughs> Watch a big session, this one ledge we found on a little side street, and we just did a bunch of tricks on it. That was pretty cool. heroes trying to one-up you, they were just amped to ride. They were definitely down and uh, were really hospitable, so that was good. and uh, Inman did a big carve on it, did a big flatty out of it, so that was cool. Local stole us about a mini ramp, which was actually on the beach, riding a mini ramp in Barcelona, Spain, in front of the Mediterranean Sea. days off, just walked around, went shopping or whatever. Seeing the city, seeing how the people interact. Hello, hello, my name is Aaron, I'm from Israel, professional artist, yes. One of the main staples of food here is a uh, cow leg. <laughs> kind of disturbing seeing cow legs hanging from the ceiling. Noticing the differences between here and there is always enjoyable. I couldn't believe I was going to Barcelona just because of uh, all the spots that's there and I always wanted to go there.
station. Line green. 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 See, it's pretty warm. Add one to the lift. There's my boy right there. Tight. <laughs> 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 